How to make a cleaning business website. Hello everyone, I'm Jason and in this tutorial we'll be using Wix to create a cleaning business website. So the first thing you will need to do is go onto Wix.com and the reason why I recommend that you use Wix is because its user face is quite easy to use so it is beginner friendly and also you can get started for completely free to sign up and start creating your cleaning business website you don't need to enter your credit card information or anything like that all you'll need to do is simply use your email address to create an account on Wix once you have created your account you are going to be redirected to a dashboard just like this and I want you to tap on create new site in the top right hand corner after you have tapped on create new site, you will be redirected to this page and I want you to tap on the search bar and you are going to simply type in cleaning. After typing in cleaning right here, you will see cleaning service. If you want to type out cleaning business, you can and you can see cleaning business, cleaning supplies manufacturer, house cleaning service. There are numerous options that come under the cleaning service business. You can select whichever one that suits your business. Then you are going to tap on next. After you have tapped on next, you are going to be redirected to a dashboard. And from here, I want you to fill in some information. And by filling in this information, you will be allowing the AI to assist you with creating a professional website. So you can see right here, on the dashboard I want you to enter your business name so you could enter your business name right here after you have entered your business name you can add your business address then you are going to tap on next in the bottom right hand corner then from here you can enter your working hours so let's say I'm open from 8 a.m. in the morning so my business is open from 8 a.m. in the morning to 5 p.m. in the evenings so let me select 5 p.m. and I'm open from Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday and closed on the weekends then I'm going to tap on next after you have done that you can select the services that you offer so do you offer residential cleaning yes I do commercial cleaning move in and out cleaning you can select that and you can scroll down and you can select the numerous services and select whichever one that you offer. Also, if you don't see a service that you would like to offer for your website, you can simply tap on create new service and enter that new service. Once you are finished, you are going to tap on next again. Then from here, you can enter your staff member's name and email address. Then you are going to tap on next. And do you accept online payments? More than likely you will be accepting online payments. So you are going to tick that. And do you accept in-person payments? You can tick that if you do. And I would recommend that you tick manage on the go with Wix owner app. Because this will allow you to edit and monitor your website from your mobile device. Once you have internet, you'll be able to do this from anywhere in the world. And also, if you plan on selling any digital or physical products, you can simply tick this box. Then you're going to tap on next again, then tap on continue to dashboard. Once on the dashboard, I'm going to show you some other stuff that you need to complete the setup of your cleaning. Once on the dashboard, what I want you to do is scroll down, then you're going to tap on set up payments. As this is very important to set up the payment methods that we'd like to accept. So for example, let's accept PayPal. So we are going to simply tap right where you see connect. And from there you could enter your PayPal information. Then you can also set up CXP to accept debit and credit card. And you can also set up manual payments. And if you would like to set up more payment options, all you have to do is tap on see more payment options. And from there, you can connect the numerous payment platforms that Wix provide. And I want you to pay attention to the left hand menu option. 
So let's say for example, you would like to do some marketing or so on. All you would have to do is go over to the left hand menu option, tap on marketing and SEO. And from there, you can set up your Google business profile or you can start doing email marketing or so on. And also to view your billing and payments better yet. You can simply select invoices if you would like to create invoices or you can select quotations if you would like to create quotations. And to view your booking calendar, all you have to do is go up to the top left hand corner, then tap on booking calendar and from there you can select calendar. You can also set up work schedule if you want. Once everything is to your liking, I want you to scroll back up, tap on home. After selecting home, we are going to now start designing our site. So we are going to tap on design site in the top right hand corner. After you have tapped on design site, you are going to tap on pick a template. And once on this page, you can see numerous templates that you can choose from to start your cleaning business website. And we recommend, I would normally recommend that you use one of the top two that you see best match. So let's say, for example, I want to use this one. I would tap on edit, see how your website currently looks. And to start doing some changes, all you have to do is tap on the particular section that you would like to edit. So let's say, for example, first, let's increase the zoom. So let's say, for example, you would like to edit the header section. All you have to do is simply tap on the header section. After you have done that, let's say I want to change the name right here. I could tap right there, then tap on change text. And from there, I could change the name. So let's say I want to name it Jason. I could do that. Also, if I would like to make any other changes, I can. All you have to do is hover over the section. Then from there, you could select quick edit to make a change. So if you would like to change anything else, let's say you want to change the text right here. You can simply tap on the text, then tap on quick edit. After you have tapped on quick edit, a box will open up on the right hand column. And from there, if you would like to change the background image, you can. If you would like to change the text, you can as you see right here. And that's how to edit any section on your Wix website. All you have to do is tap on it. And if you would like to add text or an image to your Wix website, to do that, you'll need to go over to the left hand menu option, tap on add elements, that's the plus at the top. Then you'll see text. All you'll need to do is tap and drag the text box that you would like to add. If you'd like to add an image, it is the same thing. If you'd like to add a button, it's the same thing. All you have to do is hover over button, then select the type of button that you would like to add, and you'll simply drag and place it onto the website. Anything that you like to add, whether it is a contact form, gallery, a video, anything at all, Wix allows you to do that by simply tapping on add elements and selecting the element that you would like to add. Now to edit a particular page or to add a page, all you have to do is tap on the third icon from the top left hand corner, right where you see pages and menu. To add a new page, all you'll need to do is tap on add page. Or to edit a page, all you'll have to do is tap on the page that you'd like to edit. So let's say I want to edit the FAQ page. I'll tap on FAQ. Then after doing that, you can currently see how the FAQ looks. So all I would need to do now to make any changes is simply tap on Manage FAQs. And from there, I'll be able to add FAQ questions and answers. And if you would like to change the color concept of your website, or change the theme, you can by going over to the left hand menu option, tapping right where you see the capital A that says site design, then tap on change theme. After you have done that, you will see numerous themes that you can use or numerous color concepts that you can use. So let's say I want to change it to Chevy. All I would have to do is tap on that and you can see that the color has changed. Or if I would like it to be contemporary, all I would have to do is tap on that. Once it is to your liking, you can go over to the top right hand corner and tap on publish to publish your new website. But to preview the website, 
all you'll need to do is tap on preview at the top right there. So let's say I want to preview it. I'll tap on preview and you can see how it currently looks right here. And that's it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative on how to create a cleaning service website.